All right, you guys, since my camera's been acting up, and I'm pretty sure I'm going to take a nap today, so today will probably be, be like a lazy day for me. We're going to do it. Um, we're going to water test, waterproof test the Samsung Galaxy S5 because I have it, and um, I just want to know if it's waterproof, so let's find out, shall we? I am, I'm terrified, to be honest with you, but I, I do want to know if it's waterproof for the summer, so... Um, Let's find out. First thing we're gonna need is a phone and some water. Here we go. Time lapsed. Time lapsed. Anyway, statistically it's supposed to be, statistically, I should say. Before I was cut off, statistically it's supposed to be three meters, I believe, is what it is. That sounds deep. Maybe it's less than that. Either way, it's supposed to be waterproof. So let me make sure I got everything covered. All the seals are good. And um, you know what, just for kicks, let's put some music on. See if you can hear it. All right, let's do this, here we go. Oh, this feels so awkward putting a phone in the water. You can still hear it, it's playing uh, My Body by Young the Giant. Well, I think it works, for now. Can't say I'd do this on purpose, though. It's clean! <laughs> I actually want to see if I can, uh... Before my phone cuts off, or my camera cuts off again, I just dumped it in the water and... I'm trying to blow the water out of the speaker, and it works. Nice. I'm impressed. That's cool. <laughs> that felt so wrong on every level. You just don't put a phone in the water. <laughs> oh, that was weird.